All right, so thank you very much. Always make it up to watch Dazzy TV. So I have the winner for face of UPSA 2022. Congratulations, madam. Thank you very much. All right, so but before we go ahead, maybe somebody's watching live right now, don't know you. Who is Nihat? Quick one before we continue. Okay, so Nihat is a very passionate young lady. She's very passionate about what she do, and she makes sure that she does not let the words of other people influence her. She goes with her heart, and I advise every young lady out there to go with their heart and put in extra effort, and what they want shall be theirs. And they should pray too. Prayer is very important. How was it? I mean, you were 12 in number for you to be chosen among 12 candidates. How does you feel? Wow, the, the feeling is like, words can't explain the feeling right now. It hasn't been easy. You have to combine it with studies, rehearsals and all that. It hasn't been easy. And right now, we just have to say thank God and thanks to everyone who voted, every single person who supported us out there. Yes. What do you think did the magic for you? I think it's God. <laughs> Prayers, because... They voted for everybody. The competition was tough. Um, everybody put out their best, but God chose the winner. So it's God. Yes. So what do you intend to use your office to influence others on campus? Um, I would like to um, influence everybody in a very good way, for sure. Um, I would like to implement my project, and I pray and I hope and I know for sure by his grace the project is going to come out really well and have a great impact on students on campus and do not so share with us with your project okay so my project is now the income supplement agenda and it's about equipping students with entrepreneurial skills so students who have the opportunity to learn a variety of skills which is not just limited to, uh, to vocational but also public speaking and IT like everything what they want to do their heart desire <laughs> once again congratulations it's not easy for you to be a queen of this noble university but before we go finally any appreciation to people that contributed to your success? Yes, like, I'll, first of all, I'll thank God. Yes, God, my family, my friends, my my friend here, Subaha, my training team, everyone that took part in the training, my classmates, all, all you PSA students out there, everyone every single person contributed to me being the face of upsa today and i wouldn't be here without them all right once again on behalf of the viewers of dazzy tv i want to say that congratulations to you and you deserve to be the queen of upsa thank you very much for watching dazzy TV. my name is isaac dazzy keep it locked yeah. all right so i have the women's commissioner here i mean you are the organizer of the whole event yes. Before I start a conversation, congratulations to you. Thank you very much. It's not easy for you to put at such a massive uh, event. How, how, how do you feel, I mean, after coming out with such a wonderful event? To be frank, I'm very, very, very happy. I feel I have accomplished my mission for becoming the SLC Women's Commissioner. Was it part of your manifesto, I mean, your campaign messages to the students? Yes, please. That was my last um, policies that I, I told the student population I'm going to accomplish before I leave office. So this, this is actually my last event because um, from next week we are going to have our election. So this is my last event as the SLC Women's Commissioner. Okay. Is it the first time or you are maybe the continuation from the previous uh, administration? Okay. For the past two years, we've never hosted a face of UPSA because of the pandemic. So right after 2019, we are having this phase of UPSA in this 2022 year. UPSA is actually a professional school and so far for this year, the motto for all ladies was to break the bias. This year, UPSA Women's Commissioners and the ladies on board have really broken the bias. So I encourage all those out there who would like to, um, let's say so far, they are still thinking of which institution they would like to study in. I um, I recommend UPSA to you all. Yeah. Okay. So my name is Norana Atre Ajete. 
what they are saying. The thing is, I know your friend. What they are saying. Thank you very much. And once again, congratulations. This this was massive for you to. Hey, before you go, for you to pull these celebrities to grace your occasion, like Tracy success. I mean, what I say is wow, Charlie. It's not easy. Kelvin boy, uh, Mona for real, Giovanni as an MC. How was the whole preparation? We lay down um, some plans, myself and my deputy. So we love networking. We were able to pull um, Priority Solution Limited on board, Edu Concepts on board, Doman on board. So through this networking, they were able to help us get to that highest place. So through them, we were able to get these um, prominent people. All right, so once again, congratulations to you. And thank you very much for speaking to Dazzy TV. All right, thank you very much. All right, so there you heard from the, um, the S, the Women's Commissioner, of University of Professional Study. Nayak, she is the winner for UPSA phase, phase of UPSA 2022. I hope you enjoy watching the live coverage from University of Professional Studies Auditorium. Once again, my name is Isaac Dazi and thank you very much for watching. See you some other time. Bye-bye.